Sherilton. Well, we finally made it. We sure took the scenic route. And that big bearded meanie didn't follow us, did he? Don't worry. He'd never follow us into a place like this. Hey, check out this shop. It looks pretty interesting. Welcome. Please browse all you want. Looks like antiques. They're very nice. Why do all the folks around here seem so tense? <sighs> Word is, foreign spies broke into a military laboratory in the capital. The king sent his personal guards here. They're interrogating anyone who even looks at them funny. Not very good for business, that's for sure. Uh, right. Um... Wow, that cup is so pretty. Yeah, it's pretty all right. Pretty expensive, that's for sure. You have a good eye, young lady. That's a genuine freet fired cup. Is that right? So this was handmade by a freet? Well, I highly doubt that. It looks like these patterns are far too wild. A freed values order over all else. <laughs> well, you talk as though you've had the honor of breaking bread with one of the four great spirits. Your observation is accurate. True freed fired ceramics are known for their geometric precision. That's odd. The stamp here says that this set was made over 18 years ago. I see. Yes? Uh, what about it? That's quite peculiar. If I'm not mistaken, mankind lost the ability to summon a freet around 20 years ago. <gasps> the freet didn't make it? What a shame. That's so disappointing. But even still, I think it's a lovely cup, so I'll take it. Of course. I'll even be happy to offer you a nice discount. <laughs> I got quite a good deal, thanks to your help. I'm Drissel Cheryl. Pleased to meet you. And I am the young madam's butler, Rowan. I'm happy to be at your service. Thanks again. You simply must join me for tea at my manor. Well, who are we to turn down a free lunch? Shall we swing by later? I live just south of the Central Plaza. I look forward to seeing you. Do we really have time for that? Well, I can think of several reasons we might want to take advantage of her hospitality. He's right, actually. Staying at an inn could be risky with all these guards everywhere. Hmm. Very well, then. We'll take time for some tea after we traverse the town. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Sherylton. And her name was... Uh, something Cheryl? I'm guessing she has... Some connection. Ah, that's right. The peddler who sells TPOS toys might be in Sherilton. Let's ask around town and find out if anyone's seen any talking stuffed animals. Wow! I'm so excited! Alright, cool. I've got a question. I wonder what they sell. Let's take a peek! Jet Black Feather Trading Post. Huh. Feathers, would you be willing to part with them? Why? Should I? Okay. These are jet black feathers. They are highly valuable item among certain collectors. If you can bring me a bunch of them, I'd be happy to exchange them for some equally valuable items of my own. Dark wings been spotted again. Huh. Noble bandit. Oh, a, a log company cargo wagon. Whoops. That's horrible. You be careful out there, you hear? Wait. So can I trade or not?
Wanna trade your fire items? Sure, let's see what he has. Whoa, nice! You could tell me what these do. Oh my god, this is Librarius or Libavius or Great Trees Fruit. Strange Core. Highlight all. Is there any way to know what these do? Let's try the 51. So it's just a guess. Uh, well, like, well, this stuff will be sellable. Unless you need them for some awesome weapon or something. And these increase your stats. Well, I'll keep it for now then. So, and pick flowers. Self determination, self rules, self respect. Um, aren't you under some king? That's not really self rule. Whoa. Let's not disturb the guards. Kurio shop owner. Forgeries are common, so I wouldn't recommend them to amateurs with an untrained eye. Wouldn't you be the same guy who just. Save point there. We don't really need the save point. Not yet. The south is Rushgar's bread basket. Everything grown, raised, or made there passes through Shelton's markets. The king may live in Fenmon, but make no mistake, Shelton is the true capital of Rushagar. Okay, if you say so. Oh, you have a quest? Hey, have you ever seen anyone who looks like me? Lo, a talking doll. It's just like the other ones I saw. Where did you see them? A toy merchant was selling them here not too long ago. Where can we see this person? I don't think he's here anymore. He said he was going to some sea haven next. Do you remember which one? Hmm. Um. No. Maybe. <laughs> this is sure taking a lot of time. Oh, that's it. It was a lot of Sea Haven. Can't say I recognize that. Oh, wait. You mean a lot of Sea Haven. Well, hey, nice work, me. Gosh, I'm so jealous. I wish my parents had bought me one of those. Tebow's now for sale. Okay. Uh. What's this? As many as I can get me. Oh, this is sandwiches. What is this? Restores ten percent HP. If you get a wizard, you get another one for free. That's okay. Not that interesting. Item shop. Do you have anything new? Well, you're yeah, just the same stuff. I don't think you can expand. Well, I did get new, a few new of these things. So you can expand this. That's it, lemon gel. Yeah, you can see 15, 21, 21, 11, 20. Some shops just have it tough. Or this should be a quick upgrade. I'm not really looking to do much. Amazingly, food vendor get, increases well. Oops. And the armor shop. Oops. Silk wings. Ruby one discount. All right. Silk wing, wings. I think a uh, window air weapon for Jude. Lumen grass. Where? On top of the okay, on top of the lamppost. Cool. 
kind of like Fenmon. I think that's it for this area. And we have our weapon shops. Wow, what a huge city! I've never been anywhere like this before. Hey, there's too many people and it's super noisy. The spirit climb here in Shelton is actually very arid. Nevertheless, the city is lush and green, thanks to a large-scale irrigation system that uses the windmills and channel spirits. Hey, what's up? Damn it, my cargo again. Getting my shipment through the military checkpoints is hard enough. I have to deal with monster attacks too. I don't know how I'm gonna get by. I wish I could get someone to wipe out the high road monsters for me, but who do I want to take a job like that? I can. I live in the north branch of the Sapstra High Road. I think that's where I got where I was just now, and then I ran back. I have no problem doing side quests, especially since they give you money and experience. Yeah. Never mind. <laughs> you can get away oh, later. Run. <laughs> wait. Did I just run back here? Oh, that's cool. Can I talk to him again? Is he still there? No, he's gone. Oh, your husband? Cool. We look at those windmills. Anyway, um, oh, can I change who I control? Set leader, Elise. Wee. to do weapons and stuff right now birds oh I thought they fly away oh that's a bunch of exclamation points the Russian government military controls that route and there's been an unusual amount of activity at their base in Fort Gandala cool taxes are going up Klein tried to oppose the king's new tax increase, but I guess even a lot from one of the six ruling houses is no match for the thug King Nachtigal. Nachtigal. However, you pronounce his name. What's this? Zenin? In. I might check that out. Where does this go? Mila? Are you nervous about something? No one's ever asked me over for tea before. It seems I'm a bit excited. Cool. Okay, so that's where we have to go. What's this place called again? Lord Manor Gates. A separate nation, but 20 years ago, with the Fen family, which of our Shugal, Shat and Klo, chose the path of unity, and the two countries became one. Joined peacefully, recognized as an autonomous province with its own independent government. We people are shut in a part of our special status. Ah, there's no beating big cities. So many interesting things for a grown man to see and do. You mean like talk to random people? So, an unknown monster has been spotted in Bermia Gorge, but no one who's seen it has lived long enough to tell us much about it. All we've managed to gather with the victims is that the monster had a weapon growing out of his body. Oh, you know what kind of monster that is. Oh, what's up? Okay. But portfolios of men, they want me to marry, okay. Well, shut up about grandchildren, but of course, that's not your problem. Thanks for taking the time to deliver these. Oh, that's the stuff we delivered. Okay. Package address to in. Okay, so we completed that. We don't have to go back to the dude. Cool. Oh, these, what lanterns? These lanterns? Cool. Um, food? Nah. 
apologize for the inconvenience. That's cool. We're not staying here anyway. Let's see what these people are up to. Let's just use drop, I guess. The weather here in Sherilton sure is nicer than it is in Ajul. Did you come here from Ajul? We did. We came in through Sapstrath Seahaven. Well, good on you for making it all this way. I bet going through that checkpoint wasn't much fun. Uh, it wasn't that bad. We used to be able to trade with Ajul freely. But now, with all these new regulations, it's almost impossible to do business. I've heard things are getting weird at Fort Gandala, too. I hear they're working on some kind of big-time spirit art. You think it's for war? It could well be. Between Rashigal and Ajul? But why? I'm sure you've seen how the King of Rashigal has been consolidating power around himself. While on the other hand, the King of Ajul is some great hero who united all of the tribes by force. Two strong rulers in two neighboring countries. It's only natural they'd start bumping against each other. There have been skirmishes, but we haven't had open war since the Battle of Fezabel 20 years ago. Hey, this could be the business opportunity of a lifetime. Oh, what? <sighs> I'm sure it's possible. But the people who got greedy during the last war were the first ones to die. Yeah, you're right. These new inspections have been pretty devastating to our business already. Hey, don't let it get you down. War isn't a certainty yet. War, huh? Yeah, business during war. Awesome. And that sarcasm, by the way. Aw, man. No. 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 Oh, well. well. I guess we go this way. Not much to do. I mean, I see the towns had something a bit different from town to town, but they all seem more or less the same. I guess you get different quests, but you can't really do those in the town itself. We've been waiting for you. Oh, apologies. Would you like a wow. pet dragon? You live here? Rashigo soldiers. Wait. Woohoo. Who was that? Have our guests departed? Welcome back. Brought your friends, I see. Klein, let me introduce you. Oh, um, I never got their names. I hear you came to my sister's aid. I'm Klein Cheryl. I'm Drissel's older brother, as you've no doubt guessed. Lord Klein is the governor here in Sherilton. Really? How rude of us to keep you waiting outside. Please, let's continue our conversation in comfort. So I guess we randomly get to talk to authority when we arrive in town. I see. So you protected my sister from wasting her money on worthless trinkets again. It's not worthless. Besides, I got a good deal and made some new friends in the bargain. Wahey! <laughs> Rowan, 
Please look after our guests. It would be my pleasure, sir. I have some matters to attend to, if you will excuse me. I've got to run, too. Huh? Nature calls. I better leave now before things get messy. So you're on some great journey, right? You simply must tell me all about your travels. Mm, well, um... I've never even been out of this town. I want to hear all about the faraway places you've been. I've never been outside either, but then... Ellie became pals with Jude and everyone. We crossed mighty oceans and explored forbidden forests. We saw giant waves and toadstools that made everyone cry. You actually sailed across the sea, Ellie? I've never even seen the sea before. What was it like? Seriously? It's vast and wild, teeming with dangerous creatures. There are giant octopuses pretending to be rocks. Rock <laughs> octopuses? You don't say! And fish and eels and clams. Oh, I've seen clams. Uh, the shells anyway. They sell shell jewelry in the shops in the plaza. It's all so gorgeous. That sounds really nice. I'll give you one of my favorite pieces as a present next time. As a token of our friendship. Icky clams turned into pretty jewelry? This I gotta see! So giving presents is a way to establish friendship? Uh, why yes. To the giver, a present is a symbol of trust. To the receiver, a present serves as a warm reminder of our friendship. And getting stuff for free doesn't stink either. I see. <laughs> it would appear my young mistress has made some very good friends. Make yourselves at home. Help yourself to tea and treats. I see we're using the new cups. Wait, that's it. Sup, dude? You got a quest? I have been in the service of Lord Klein for about two years now. He is a fine ruler despite his youth. He believes in freedom and equality for his people. If he has any real flaw, it's that he spoils Lady Dressel too much. <laughs> 